Chris with HobbyKing.com with another great, exciting product we're going to talk about today. We actually got some new uh, multi-rotor frames. And uh, holy Batman, these things are ginormous. Now this is perfect for those that want to uh, start getting into a little bit larger multi-rotors using uh, aerial uh, photography platforms or whatever you need to use these for, but don't want to break the bank with those expensive carbon fiber, you know, uh, Ferrari style frames that are just massively expensive uh, to get those uh, bigger sizes. As you can see, this one I'm holding, it's, it's ginormous. Let's uh, go ahead and put the measurement on it and get some measurements. And uh, this one's, uh, it's an 800 uh, mil frame uh, hex. Uh, this one is coming right in at um, uh, 680. And this one is about the same. Difference is quad and hex. Only difference really between these, they all use the same arms, uh, giant paddle arms, is the center plate. They reduce the size by uh, reducing the center plate. Now on these, uh, some of them have uh, power distribution boards, some of them do not. Uh, we've got about uh, 10 of them total that are gonna be activated. So definitely uh, scroll through all of them and pick the one that's best for you. Now on these, they don't come with landing gear, but they have quite a few provisions on the bottom and we're gonna have those landing gear in the uh, related items that you're gonna be able to take a look if you're using uh, such uh, like as a, a three axis gimbal or something like that. Now these arms are extremely rigid. I know a lot of, uh, uh, Multi-rotors are based with these plastic arms. There's a lot of concern as far as their flexibility as they come out towards the motor and how strong they are. And as you can see, I'm holding this frame up and, uh, and bouncing it. It's, uh, it's extremely rigid. It doesn't flex a whole lot. There's a lot of plastic in there. It's, it's actually still pretty light frame. Uh, so you've got no worries there. And obviously due to the size of these pucks that are on there, you're gonna be able to put some giant motors on there, some 4010s, 3508s, uh, swing some huge props on this. Uh, so it's a fantastic platform fairly inexpensive to get into these uh, big multi-rotors. Like I said, we've got quite a few coming out, so you can go ahead and uh, take a look and uh, pick one up, experiment with it, uh, use it, and always in a worst case uh, scenario, you can use these arms as a paddle, beat your kids with it. I'm kidding, don't do that. Anyway, as always, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you next time.